Mr. Human Resource of the Navaratna Company, Naval Lignite Corporation, India Limited, is here to be the chief guest of our 14th graduation day ceremony, to deliver the graduation address, and to distribute the certificates to the graduates. As your biography is remarkable and inspiration to the graduates and the gathering, I, I would like to highlight the same, sir. Sir, your wealth of knowledge and expertise in the field of human resources, coupled with your solid educational background, is truly remarkable. Holding a postgraduate degree in political science with an MBA in human resource management, you have showcased your profound understanding of our area of expertise. Throughout your extensive career, serving as an executive director at Steel Authority of India Limited for over three decades, you have excelled in various domains such as recruitments, industrial relations, and organizational development. Sir, your adaptability and proficiency are underscored by your tenure at different units of sale. Additionally, your significant contributions to skill development initiatives, such as a director in the Indian Iron and Steel Sector Skill Council, highlight your commitment to fostering talent and innovation. Sir, we are honored and grateful for your presence today. Your life achievements, insights, and wisdom will inspire our graduating students as they embark on their journey beyond the walls of institution. As NLC has the power of illuminating the nation, your presence representing the power of Navratha Company, NLC, will definitely radiate either your college or different dimensions in future. I welcome you, sir. I am so proud to welcome Sri K. Venkatraman, the esteemed printer and publisher of Dinamalar Puducherry, the greatest daring personality who is our neighbor, the young man with a dream and full of fire to realize that dream to build up stronger India through energetic, enthusiastic, smart, innovative, fit people with noble character. Sri Venkat Raman's leadership extends over in Vilupuram, Kalakuruchi and Kadalu district. Additionally, he holds the position of owner and director at Winner Diary Private Limited Puducherry. Sir, your compassionate approach towards your employees, whom you regard as part of your extended family, is widely admired. Your dedication extends beyond the workplace as you actively support their families as well. Quality education holds a special place in your heart. It's evident through your initiatives supporting students from preschool to higher education levels, such as Patam, Vadihati, and Ungalal Mudiyum. Furthermore, your organization of stress management workshops for educators, including school and college principals, through Principles Conclave, showcases your commitment to enhancing the quality educational landscape. Your dedication to nurturing skilled youth for the future is commendable as you set a sterling example of physical health and fitness. You ensure impartiality and fairness in news dissemination, steadfastly avoiding any favoritism. Your acceptance of invitation reflects your respect for women and your thirst to empowering them through quality education. Sir, even though you have been crossing the campus of Idaya since your childhood, for the first time you have been stepped inside the holy soil of Idaya today on 6th April 2024, only because of your love, concern and respect you, are, you nourish and cherish to lift this women college to the greatest heights of the world through your powerful mastermind and through the power of media. I welcome you, sir. It is indeed a great pleasure and honor to welcome Professor Chandrasekhar Rao, 
the dean cdc pondicherry university to this 14th graduation day ceremony so your distinguished career as and significant contributions to pondicherry university have made an enduring impact on the academic landscape as the dean of the college development council your leadership has been essential in shaping trajectory of our institution your roles as the dean of the school of management head of the department of banking technology and head of the department of commerce showcase your resourcefulness and unwavering commitment to academic excellence your expertise in corporate finance financial management international finance banking technology statistics and data analytics has significantly enriched academic progress having served as head of the department dean of the school and dean of the college development council at pondicherry university your contributions have been instrumental in the growth and success of the institution we also recognize your visionary leadership as a retired professor from a central university where you introduced innovative mba program synthesizing technology and management the establishment of mba banking technology and mba financial technology under your guidance reflects your forward thinking approach to education you had 34 years of teaching experience for post graduate graduate mcom and nba students coupled with the research endeavors in corporate finance security analysis and portfolio management showcase your enduring commitment to academic excellence furthermore your current responsibilities in coordinating the functioning of 116 affiliated colleges to pondicherry university and your active involvement in implementing the national educational policy nep 2020 demonstrate your dedication to advancing education at both local and la national levels sir i feel proud to have you with us i feel personally you are representing as my father as my guru as my guide as the well wisher of idaya family so so happily and proudly i welcome you you are the source of inspiration to all it gives me immense pleasure to extend a warm welcome to dr chandrasekhar the former principal of jawagar science college neveli i am grateful for your initiation selfless personal interest and effort to inspire she is sameswarup the director human resource of the navratna company nlc to accept our invitation to be the chief guest of today's ceremony sir you are widely regarded as the beacon of knowledge simplicity gentleness and the epitome of humanity as the former principal of jawagar science college neveli your name vibrates with the reverence and admiration in educational circles far and wide your presence amidst us levels our ceremony to a level of distinction and significance welcome you sir it is my distinct honor and privilege to extend a heartfelt welcome to professor dhyagarajan whose name has been pronounced for his extended service sir your esteemed presence adds a special significance to our celebrations your dedication in helping others which is widely recognized and deeply admired resonates strongly with the values we uphold at our institution welcome you sir a special welcome to our esteemed guests shri winston jayraj and shri madhi annamma thomas former additional chief manager hr material management nlc neveli to our 14th graduation day ceremony you both are our well wishers pillars of strength and the architects of success behind this momentous memorable occasion so welcome you both i extend a warm welcome to all the graduates the gold medalists the pg graduates the ug graduates who are our stars the queen of the 14th graduation day ceremony your dedication and perseverance have led you to this remarkable achievement and we celebrate your success with pride today you are our joy you are our pride you are our strength you are the children and daughters of idaya college forever idaya is our alma mater you are most welcome always always especially on this memorable day on behalf of everyone gathered here dear stars and queens we welcome you all i also welcome our dear parents thank you very much for interesting us uh, with the education growth of your children today we honor your support and celebrate the success of your daughters warm welcome to all the parents i extend a warm welcome to our teaching and non teaching faculties whose unwavering dedication and commitment has shaped the minds and future of the young graduates 
Thank you for your invaluable contributions to Idayo College. My heartfelt welcome to all the sisters and near and dear one, your spiritual guidance and leadership have enriched the Idayo family. We are honored to have your presence today. I welcome members of media, the Doc Kibans team and the students volunteers. Thank you for your hard work and dedication in ensuring the success of this event. Let the powerful, loving, supporting energy of everyone gathered here may brighten the hope of the individual, the joy of the family, the peace of the society, and the integrity of India. Jai Hind, welcome you all. I invite Dr. Mary Brito, Vice Principal of our college, to present a brief report about our college. Pleasant good morning to everyone present here. I feel proud to say a few words about the college. Idaya College of Arts and Science for Women, Pakamudayanpet Puducherry, is affiliated to Pondicherry University, started in the year 2004. The college is committed to serve the economically marginalized and the less privileged. Idaya College, which is located in Puducherry, admits the majority of the students who come from economically weaker backgrounds, less privileged social situations, single parent families, and who are orphaned. Idaya College offers free education to 20% of our students and 50% concession to sports students and also provides concession to others in need. Idaya College is the only institution in and around Puducherry with nominal fees, ensuring accessibility to quality education, skill development, and placement opportunities. The vision of the college is it envisage educating women for life, mold and empower them to become efficient leaders of our nation. The mission of our college is to imbibe among the students' community intellectual enlightenment, spiritual growth, emotional and moral upright, social commitment and responsibility. Motto of the college is Arise and Shine, which aims in shaping the youth, promoting the holistic personality through value-based education. The courses offered in our college, so we have eight undergraduate courses and three postgraduate courses. In undergraduate courses, we have B.Sc. Mathematics, B.Sc. Physics, B.Com. Corporate Secretaryship, B.Sc. Biochemistry, B.Sc. Computer Science, B.Com. B.A. English and B.C.A. The postgraduate courses are M.Sc. Mathematics, M.A. English and M.Com. Gold Medalist. Every year, our students have brought great honor to the college by receiving gold medal from Pondicherry Central University for their outstanding academic excellence. So far, 48 of our students have been awarded these prestigious gold medals. Placement opportunities. College offers excellent placement opportunities. Around 50% of our students secure placements via campus drives. Another 50% of our students opt higher education in clearing all India entrances. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. I request Dr. S. Tiagarajan, Professor from Pantruti, to felicitate the gathering with a few words. Yapila Padal Enum, Yardarum Gavide Enum, Mapala Bola Yenni, Madile Endum Yendan, Mupila Tamide, Yen Mutana Vanakam Tande. Indriye, Patamalipi Vidavirke, Talami Danga Vandirikum, NLC, Mani the Valature Yakanar, Manbimaka Aya Vergale, In the Negeti, Valture Varanga, Varihi Purindrikindre, Tinamalar, Padipasir, Aya Vergale, Matie, Palgale Karakatilirunde, Varihi Purindrikindre, Dean. Man be Mukhe, Sandra Sagar, Aya Avergale In the Walter Evanga Varga Purundrikin Ray, Naiveli, Munal, Javagar, Arivil Kalirundia, Mudalver, Tere, Viti, Sandra Sagar Naya, Avergale Arasi Elkor, Annai, 
இந்திரா காந்தி அறிவியலுக்கோர் கல்பனா சாவ்லா வீரத்திற்கோர் வேலு நாச்சியார் தொண்டிற்கோர் அன்னை தெரசா இந்த அத்தனை பண்புகளும் ஒருங்கே பெற்று விளங்குகின்ற உங்கள் கல்லூரி முதல்வர் அருள்திரு சகோதரி பாத்திமா சிஸ்டர் அவர்களே துறை தலைவர்களே பேராசிரியர்களே நெய்வேலி தொழிலதிபர் அருமை நண்பர் வின்சென்ட் ஜெயராஜ் அண்ணம்மா அவர்களே நாளைய உலகை ஆளப்போகின்ற பட்டதாரி தங்க தாரகைகளை உங்கள் அனைவருக்கும் என் பணிவான வணக்கத்தை நான் தெரிவித்துக் கொள்கின்றேன் பொதுவாக பாண்டிச்சேரி என்றால் இளைஞர்களிலிருந்து முதியவர் வரை அனைவருக்கும் பிடிக்கும் ஏன் என்று சொன்னால் அதற்கு மூன்று சிறப்பு அம்சங்கள் இந்த ஊருக்கு உண்டு ஒன்று பாண்டிச்சேரி என்றால் நீர்வளம் மிகுந்த நாடு ஒன்று இரண்டாவது கல்வி சாலைகள் மிகுந்த நாடு நிறைய பள்ளிகள் ஏறத்தாழ எழுநூத்தி முப்பத்தி நான்கு பள்ளிகள் உள்ளன கிட்டத்தட்ட நூற்றி இருபத்தி நான்கு கல்லூரிகள் உள்ளன இரண்டு பல்கலைக்கழகங்கள் உள்ளன கல்வி சாலைகள் நிறைந்த ஒரு நாடு பாண்டிச்சேரி நாடு அதோடு மட்டுமல்லாமல் ஆன்மீக துறையில் கோயில்கள் புனித ஸ்தலங்கள் நிறைந்த நாடு இந்த நாடு அருள் திரு அமலர்போவ அன்னை ஆலயம் திரு இருதய ஆண்டவர் பெரிய கோயில் முதலிய பல்வேறு கோயில்கள் நிறைந்த ஊர் இந்த ஊர் இந்த பாண்டிச்சேரியில் ஆயிரத்தி எண்ணூற்றி நாற்பத்தி நான்காம் ஆண்டு அக்டோபர் பதினான்காம் தேதி ஹிமாக்குலட் சகோதரிகள் திருச்சபை தோற்றுவிக்கப்பட்டது இந்த சபையினுடைய நோக்கம் உருவாக்கம் சுவிசேஷம் சுகாதாரம் கல்வி பணி எந்த என்ற நான்கு கருத்துக்களை அடிப்படையாக கொண்டு இந்த சபை பணியாற்ற ஆரம்பித்தது அடித்தட்டு பெண்களுடைய வாழ்க்கை முன்னேற வேண்டும் என்பதற்காக அப்பெண்கள் புனிதப்படுத்துதல் அப்பெண்களுக்கு கல்வியை கொடுக்க வேண்டும் என்ற நோக்கத்தோடு மிக சிறப்பாக இந்த சபை இயங்கி வருகிறது மேலும் இந்த சபையினுடைய இன்னும் இரண்டு நல்ல அருமையான கருத்து என்னவென்று கேட்டால் அன்பு தியாகம் இந்த அன்புடைமை தியாகம் என்ற இரண்டின் அடிப்படையிலே மிக சிறப்பாக இயங்கி வருகின்ற இந்த ஹிமாக்குலட் சகோதரிகள் திருச்சபை நடத்துகின்ற இதையா கலை மற்றும் அறிவியல் கல்லூரியில் கலந்து கொள்வதில் நான் மிகவும் பெருமை அடைகின்றேன் பொதுவாக உலகத்திலேயே மிக உயர்ந்த ஒன்று என்னவென்று கேட்டால் கல்வி இந்த கல்வி விண்ணை விடையும் மண்ணை விடவும் இன்னும் சொல்லப்போனால் பொண்ணை விடவும் மிக உயர்ந்தது எடுக்கோ என்ற லத்தீன் சொல்லிலிருந்து எஜுகேஷன் என்ற ஒரு சொல் உருவானது தமிழிலே கல்வி கல் என்றால் தோண்டுதல் நிலத்தை தோண்ட தோண்ட நீர் வரும் அதுபோல் நூல்களை படிக்க படிக்க அறிவு வளரும் என்று சொல்வார்கள் ஆகவே இந்த கல்வியை பற்றி கிரேக்க அரிஸ்டாட்டில் அறிஞர் என்ற அறிஞர் தி ரூட் ஆஃப் எஜுகேஷன் ஈஸ் பிட்டர் பட் தி ஃப்ரூட் ஈஸ் ஸ்வீட் என்று மிக அழகாக குறிப்பிடுகின்றார் ஆப்பிரிக்க நாட்டு அரசியல் தத்துவ ஞானி ஆகிய வில்சன் மண்டேலா இந்த சமுதாயத்தை எதிர்த்து போராட வேண்டுமென்றால் அதற்கு கூர்மையான வலிமை மிக்க ஆயுதம் கல்வி என்ற ஒன்றாகும் என்று குறிப்பிடுகின்றார் புறநானூற்றில் ஆரிய படை கடந்த நெடுஞ்செழியன் உற்றுழி உதவியும் உருவுரல் கொடுத்தும் இற்ற நிலை முனியாது கற்றல் நன்றே என்று கல்வியின் சிறப்பை பேசுகின்றார் இம்மை பயக்குமால் ஈய குறைவென்றால் தம்மை விளக்குமால் தாமுளரா கேடின்றால் எம்மை உலகத்தும் யாங்கோணம் கல்வி போல் மம்மரருக்கும் மருந்து என்று நாளடியார் கல்வியின் சிறப்பை எடுத்துரைக்கின்றது கற்றது கைமண் அளவு கல்லாதது உலகளவு என்ற உற்ற களமுடந்தை ஓதுகின்றால் மற்ற வெறும்பந்தயம் கூற வேண்டாம் மகளிர் எறும்பும் தன் கையால் எஞ்சான் என்று கல்வியின் சிறப்பை ஆத்திச்சுடி எழுதிய அவையார் அவர்கள் மிக சிறப்பாக நமக்கு எடுத்துரைக்கின்றார் வெள்ளத்தால் அழியாது வெந்து நலால் வேகாது வேந்தரால் கொல்லத்தால் இயலாது கொடுத்தாலும் குறையாது கள்ளத்தால் எவராலும் கவரவும் முடியாது உள்ளத்தில் கல்வி எனும் பொருள் இருக்க பொருள் தேடி வேறு அலைவது ஏனோ என்று விவேக சிந்தாமணி குறிப்பிடுகின்றது ஆகவே இப்படிப்பட்ட கல்வியை எல்லோரும் கற்க வேண்டும் 
குறிப்பாக பெண்கள் இந்த கல்வியை கற்க வேண்டும் ஏன் என்று சொன்னால் ஒரு ஆண் கல்வி கற்றால் அவன் மட்டும் முன்னேறுவான் ஒரு பெண் கல்வி கற்றால் என்று சொன்னால் அந்த குடும்பமே முன்னேறும் ஆகவே ஒரு பெண் கல்வி கற்பது என்பது நாட்டிற்கும் வீட்டிற்கும் மிக சிறந்த ஒன்றாகும் ஒரு பெண் தாயாக சிறந்து விளங்குகின்றால் நல்ல மகளாக சிறந்து விளங்குகின்றால் நல்ல மனைவியாக சிறந்து இருக்கின்றால் நல்ல சகோதரி சிறந்து விளங்குகின்றார் ஆக அப்படிப்பட்ட பெண் இந்த நாட்டை ஆளப்போகின்றவர்கள் இந்த நாட்டை உருவாக்க போகின்றவர்கள் அந்த பெண்கள் பற்றிய ஒரு பதினாறு பேரும் பெற்று சீரும் சிறப்போடும் சிறப்பாக வாழ வேண்டும் என்று சொல்லி வாழ்த்தி செவி சாய்த்த உங்கள் அத்தனை பேருக்கும் வாய்ப்பளித்த விழா ஏற்பாட்டு குழுவினருக்கும் நன்றி கூறி விடைபெறுகின்றேன் நன்றி வணக்கம் Thank you sir for your heartfelt words and for making us realize the beauty of the fruit of education. I heartily invite Dr. Chandra Shekharan, professor from Neveli to felicitate the graduates on this occasion with a few words. the most respected chief guest of today's function sri samir swarup ji director human resource of neveli lignite corporation india limited the most respected special guest of honor sri k venkatraman printer and publisher of tinamular magazine puducherry the respected dean college development council of pondicherry university dr chandrasekhar rao my dear most friend dr s tyagarajan director Sangamam Arts and Science College for Women Kadambuliyur the most respected and reverend sister dr a fatima secretary and principal of this wonderful college sisters of this college heads of various departments faculty members and my dear friend vincent madam annamma thomas former technical secretary and my dear friend sujesh present a technical secretary of director hr dignitaries of the dais people from print and electronic media parents last but not least my dear young graduates good morning to everyone i am really very happy that 
the young graduates are going to obtain your degree from an apt person, our respected director, human resource. As your principal read out, he is known for his innovative administration skill, a very good man of good caliber and uh, qualities. So you are going to obtain your valuable degree from this uh, gentleman. So I am very happy about it. At this juncture, I would like to give you only one piece of advice. I think you are in a jubilant mood. I hope you will listen to my words. I served as a principal for 12 years for Jawahar Science College. Basically, I am a mathematics professor. What I wanted to stress is interdisciplinary skill is required. In this competitive world, if you want to become a hard cake, definitely interdisciplinary skill is must. Whether you are a literature student or commerce student or computer student, definitely interdisciplinary skill is required. I would like to quote it from my own uh, story. So I served as a principal for 12 years. Basically, I am a mathematics professor. What are the skill needed to run the show efficiently? As an administrator, I needed management qualities. Management qualities. Administering educated people and uh, students is a tough job. So management quality was required to me. Accountancy knowledge was required to me. A little bit of economics and psychology, this knowledge are very essential, very essential to run the show. And everyone possessing computer skill is very, very important. Even for a literature student, if you are well versed in MS office, it will be nice. So at this juncture, my dear graduates, I would like to stress you to develop interdisciplinary skill. Definitely, you will have a better future. So I am very happy that your beloved principal has given me an opportunity to stand before you, to, uh, before you and uh, give a felicitation. At this juncture, I wish you all to have a very bright future. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I invite the eminent chief guest, Sri Samir Swaroop, Director, Human Resource, Navili Lignite Cooperation India Limited, to address the graduates. Reverend Sister, Dr. Fatima, Secretary and Principal, Edia College of Arts and Science for Women, a guest for honor, Mr. Venkat Raman, Managing Director, Printer and Publisher of Dinamala, Puducherry, Dr. Chandrasekhar Rao, Dr. V. Chandrasekharan, and Dr. S. Thyagarajan. A very good morning to all of you. I would like also like to uh, bid a good morning to the heads of department, faculty members, teachers, non-teaching staff, dignitaries, and my dear students, their parents, and ladies and gentlemen. It's my pleasure and proud privilege to deliver the 14th graduation day address of this esteemed institution. It's an honor not only for me, but for my organization, NLCIL. At the outset, I would like to compliment all the graduates for the successful completion of the course. Also, I extend my congratulations to your families and to all the resource persons, your teachers, who have provided the necessary ambience and supportive care for achieving this academic distinction. Convocation is a significant milestone in everyone's academic growth. The degrees and awards 
earned by you all, a result of hard work and dedication. This is a proud moment for all of you, as much as it, it is for your teachers, guides, faculty members, and parents. Learning is a never-ending process, and I hope this wonderful college has made you ready to explore new horizons in your respective fields. Graduation is not the destiny, it is just a beginning. Beginning of a very challenging journey. We live in an era where the pace of technology transition is so fast that even as I speak, new concepts are being introduced, established paradigms are being redefined, and research is opening in new vistas. Mahatma Gandhi said on education that, the real difficulty that people have no idea of what education truly is. We assess the value of education in the same manner as we assess the value of land or shares in the stock market exchange. The goal of education is not only to make you earn a fat salary, it's rather a means to bring improvement in character and the way we deal with the various challenges in life. In today's rapidly changing world, it is imperative that you equip yourself with not only academic knowledge, but also with critical thinking skills and the thirst for lifelong learning. Remember that success is not merely measured by material wealth or professional accomplishments, but also by the positive impact you make on the lives of others. Here I would also like to share my own personal experience. I was never a great student either in school or in college. Uh, during result times, I used to request my mother, rather I would be beseeching her not to tell my marks which I obtained in the school to the other family members. Being a big joint family, we used to live. But life has been very kind to me and I feel that sincerity, honesty and willingness to adapt to various situations along with the urge to know and learn new things take you forward. As such, as a senior, I would advise you all to cultivate a positive attitude, to invest in developing your skills, and to never stop seeking newer knowledge. With the right attitude, right skills, and the right knowledge, there is no limit to what you can achieve. I would like to commend the faculty members for their unwavering commitment in nurturing and guiding, guiding these young minds. Your dedication to excellence in education has undoubtedly played a pivotal role in shaping the future leaders sitting before us today. In today's world of chaos and conflict, the role of teachers play a crucial role in teaching the survival skills and in implementing value systems in every sphere of education. Francis Bacon had pointed out, some books are to be read, some books are to be learned, some books are to be chewed and digested. If that what a book does, the inspiration of teachers goes a long way because it is the teacher who introduces books to you all. I would also like to congratulate all the parents on this joyous occasion. Your love, sacrifices and unwavering support had laid the foundation of, for the success of these young girls. May you continue to inspire and empower them to reach even greater heights in the years to come. I would like to record my appreciation for the management of Vidya College for Arts and Science for Women for successfully entering into the 20th year of its journey, dedicating towards promoting women's empowerment. Its holistic approach towards education which goes beyond academic excellence to encompass personal and professional development. By providing access to quality education, mentorship opportunities, and support services, the management has empowered countless young women to pursue their dreams and overcome societal barriers. Last but not the least, to the young women graduates, you possess immense strength resilience, and the power to effect positive change in the world. Never under underestimate the value of your voice and your potential to break barriers and sh shatter the glass ceilings. 
I urge you to be bold, to be fearless in pursuit of your dreams, and to never allow anyone to diminish your worth or undermine your capabilities. Believe in yourself. You are the architects of your own destiny. I wish you all a rewarding and satisfying career, good health, and success in all your endeavors. May God be always with you. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir, for inspiring excellence with your valuable words. Now, I invite Dr. Chandra Segar Rao, Dean, College Development Council, to address the graduates with a few words. Thank you. Good, good morning. Uh, at the outset, the director of Naivali, Lignet Corporation, and the the CEO of a very important newspaper in Pondicherry, and the principal of the Jawhar College, which is popularly known every year. They send lots of students to the university campus. And uh, the principal of this college, the young graduates. It is a privilege to me, on behalf of the Pondicherry University, on behalf of the vice chancellor, on behalf of the registrar, controller of exams, I have come here to formally confer Pondicherry University degrees to all the Idiya College students. This is the, the second biggest women's college in the Union Territory of Pondicherry. I'm very happy today, so many of you graduating, and I'm also very happy to see you receiving gold medals in our university con convocation every year, year after year, in different disciplines. That speaks about the quality of education being delivered in this uh, campus. After all, whichever is the college, it's our franchise unit. It is all Pondicherry. You are Pondicherry University graduates. So with this, I wish you all great in your uh, careers. See, after all, three years stay in this campus is likely to provide you the next 30 years career. The skills that is taught in the campus, knowledge that is given, is uh, likely to provide you the direction for your entire life. So I wish you a great days on this occasion. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. For this most prestigious moment, I am pleased to invite our eminent chief guest, Shri Sameswarup, Director, Human Resource, Neveli Lignite Corporation India Limited, Neveli, and the principal, Reverend Sister Dr. A. Fatima, to honor the graduates with the gold medals. Let the candidates of gold medalists be now presented by Dr. S. Mary Brito, Vice Principal of this college. I feel very proud to announce the gold medalist, B.Sc. Mathematics, Krishni, Pondicherry University gold medal.
वी I call upon Mrs. K. Kalpana, Head Department of English, to present the candidates for admission to the degree of Master of Arts in the Department of English. I. Congratulations to the PG graduates. Now, UG, I call upon Mrs. Aura Sweetlin, Head Department of Mathematics, to present the candidates for admission to the degrees of Bachelor of Science in the Department of Mathematics. I, Mrs. Aura Sweetlin, Head Department of Mathematics, present unto you these candidates.
I call upon Dr. K. Shakila, Head Department of Physics, to present the candidates for admission to the degrees of Bachelor of Science in the Department of Physics. I, Dr. K. Shakila, Head Department of Physics, present unto you these candidates in person who have been certified by Pondicherry Central University after the examination to be duly... I call upon Dr. A. Rosary Ramona Fernando, Head Department of Corporate Secretaryship, to present the candidates for admission to the degree of Bachelor of Commerce in the Department of Corporate Secretaryship. I, Dr. A. Rosary Ramona Fernando, Nisha B. Pavitra J. 
ಗುಡಿ ಪಿ ಪ್ರಿಯದರ್ಶಿನಿ ಎ ಪ್ರಿಯದರ್ಶಿನಿ ಎಸ್ ಪ್ರಿಯದರ್ಶಿನಿ ಎಂ ಪ್ರಿಯದರ್ಶಿನಿ ಮೆಹರ್ ಬಿ ಪ್ರಿಯಂಕಾ ಎ ಪ್ರಿಯಂಕಾ ಎಂ ಪ್ರಿಯಂಕಾ ಎಂ ರಾಗಿಣಿ ವಿ ಜಿ ರಹಮತು ನಿಶಾ ಎಂ ರಮ್ಯಾ ಎಂ ರಾಸ್ವಿಯಾ ಎಂ ರೀತಾವಧಿ ಡಿ ರೂಬಲಾ ಎಸ್ ಸಂಧ್ಯಾ ಎಸ್ ಸಂಗೀತಾ ಎಸ್ ಜಿ ಯುವ ಶ್ರೀ ಇ ಹೌದು 
Sveta Shri S. of computer science to present the candidates for admission to the degree of bachelor of science in the department of computer science i a mrs vimala vinarasi head department of computer science present unto you these candidates in person who have been certified by pondicherry central university after the examination to be duly qualified to receive the degree of bachelor of science for the batch 2017 to 2020 of vidya college of arts and science for women Akshaya K.